you some amazing things we did for this cellar, starting with the glass. So this is a frameless application. This is a three quarter inch glass. We decided to tint the glass because there's a lot of windows around here and getting any sunlight in there probably wouldn't make sense. So we did a frameless glass application for the cellar. So why don't we, why don't we get in here and I can show you some really cool things that we did. So starting with this cellar is 616 bottles worth of capacity. What we want to do is have a lot of different shelves and have a lot of visibility of the bottles with, and what we did here is add a channel to be route out the wood to create a channel so that we can have a, a good lighting source, LED light source to be able to light all the different reveals that we have in into the uh, cellar. Again, there's 616 bottles. This is the alder wood with a black stain and lacquer. So when you're walking anywhere in the house from the kitchen or from the front door, we have a horizontal display. And again, as you can see, the bottle rests inside the shelf so that the bottles can't just fall out and roll out. We have some cubicles or we call them cubbies that we have as well. You could put some case storage in there or you can just put the bottles as you see. We have the reveals again with the lighting that's coming down. And this is something unique that we're starting to do a lot more. This is our cork Ford 750s. But instead of doing the old style 750s where it's kind of the traditional wine racks, we're now making them more into that Y to make it have a really good look. Again, cork forward here, make sure that the bottles cannot fall out. And then case storage. So you can see the cases from walking into the house or from the kitchen. You can see also the case storage. We built a small table here, tasting table, open a bottle. You know, obviously you can't something in there as well. And then as we go into back in the cellar again, we kind of co uh, copycat or mimic everything we did on the other side. Again, horizontal displays to show in the dining room. And again, more reveals, cubicles, and the Y750s to get a little bit more of a better look, more of a modern look than just the old cork forward lattice that we have in there. And what we also did is we put a wine guardian in here. Wine guardian is a fantastic cooling unit. It's kind of the Mercedes Benz of the cooling units out there. As you can hear, completely silent. You can't hear the cooling unit. It's at a perfect 55 degrees and the humidity is right now at around 60%. So it's optimal cooling unit for the environment. But what we also did in the back of the room is that we lined it with some walnut. So the back panels are walnut, kind of match that walnut. And see, as you could see those veins there in black, we matched it with the black alder stain as well to kind of contrast to one another in the room. And as you can see the ducts up in there, both the supply and return as well.